Be on alert. That's the warning from a man who learned the hard way after he was stabbed while walking home after picking up some food. The assault happened in South Denver two weeks ago near Federal Boulevard and Mexico Avenue. In Denver, reported cases of aggravated assault have been steadily increasing. Already this year, there have been more than 1,150 cases compared to 1,130 cases this time last year. Tonight, your reporter in Denver, Jasmine Arenas, joins us with that man's story and how this community is coming together to support him. Hey, Tori, it was at this small field located inside the shops in Northfield where community members gathered for an all day tournament to collect funds for a local soccer player who nearly lost his life. He tells me this work is tremendous and what the community did for him will absolutely help him. But his message out tonight is be alert. A community of athletes supporting one of their own, doing what they do best playing soccer. The soccer community is really strong, so I just feel like if it happened to anybody in the soccer community, we would support them. Jasmine Garcia helped organize the all day soccer tournament where 12 teams came together to raise funds for Jose Felix Elias, a United Premier Soccer League player for the Indios Denver and now transferring to Aurora FC. We love soccer. We we love the soccer community. You know, we just wanted to to try something that, that, you know, we were passionate about. But that passion is currently on hold. So I was just walking home and uh, I was uh, assaulted by somebody. Surveillance video shows the moments before Jose Felix was assaulted. He says he was stabbed once, but was able to get away. You know, I was trying to fight for my life and uh, I ended up, uh, I tried to trip him. I ended up like landing between his legs. He was just uh, standing over me, just trying to stab me. Fighting for his life, he says he was happy the ambulance got there quickly. I had to be rushed uh, to an emergency surgery, so I was lucky to escape with my life. And now happy to be alive. He says this incident taught him to be more vigilant of his surroundings, something everyone should follow. It was just some random act. It wasn't like he was looking for me or like, like someone that had it out for me. It was just, you know, unlucky, bad, wrong time, wrong place, you know. Now he tells me that he'll be out of work for about four to 12 weeks, which is why this help is going to be so tremendous and impactful for him. He also tells me that he hopes to play for Aurora FC at the end of the season. In Denver, Jasmine Arenas, uh, back to you, Tori. A good reminder to stay alert, Jasmine. Thank